Similar in operation to the smaller Practical and Master versions, the XL Twister is more powerful still, with a greater working capacity thanks to its rugged, extendable handles. Before you start twisting, always ensure the twister collar is well lubricated by using the lubrication hole in the top of the boss housing. To twist flat bars, you feed one end of the bar into the round collar and use the gripping screws to hold the bar where you want the form twist to start. For larger flat bars, you can use just the two horizontal screws to grip it, but on smaller bars, you may need to use the other two vertical screws to hold it centrally in the collar. At the other end of the bar, grip the bar at the point where you want the twist to end by using the two gripping screws. You will also notice the height setting screw, which is an especially handy feature when setting up the twister for repeated twisting of lots of bars. With the bar you want to twist firmly gripped at each end, you can start twisting the bar by rotating the handles in the collar. To reduce the effort required for larger bars, you can use the extra leverage provided by the extendable handles. Each rotation makes the twist tighter and tighter, but a note of caution here is to avoid over-twisting, as any bar will eventually buckle if too many twists are attempted. When finished, unclamp the bar at each end and then admire the quality and consistency of your twist. When twisting square bars, use all four gripping screws in the collar to ensure the bar is properly centered. Also use the height setting screw in the slide to keep the square bar level. Twisting is then performed in exactly the same way as with flat bar. When complete, you have a consistent twist produced very quickly. Essential when producing lots of identical twisted bars. The XL Twister can be supplied with an optional kit that will allow you to produce high quality and bulbous baskets that can be incorporated into your finished metalwork as a decorative feature. To make these baskets, you first need to tack weld four square or round bars of a set length together to form a cluster. The kit contains a special drive thread and surrounding nut which fits into the boss housing in place of the normal collar. This is clamped down as per our detailed instructions provided with the kit. The handles are then transferred from the collar to the capstan at the end of the drive thread. The kit also includes two sets of gripping components, one large and one small. Each set has a separate gripping collar, which itself is held on the end of the drive thread by a special pin, which in turn is kept in position by a plastic split ring. The matching collar at the other end is part of the double-ended carriage, which is fixed into the twister slide. You simply select the size you require and set these up in the twister as shown here and you then line the end stop up with the correct hole in the body for the size of basket being made. Finally, drop the key into place to lock it there. Now you rotate the handles between one and one quarter turns in the direction shown. Next slide the specially designed wedge plate between the slide and the retaining lip of the end stop. Now you rotate the handles back the other way until all four bars in the cluster are fully opened out. Then to ensure an even spaced basket, you drop the two halves of this clever spacer device into the middle of the basket and join it together and hook it onto one of the strands. 
Now you continue rotating it in the direction shown to form an even basket. When this is done, you can remove the spacer and the wedge to release the basket. At this point, you can choose to make the basket even more bulbous. This is done by removing the plastic split ring, taking the drive pin out and then rotating the handles to apply more squeeze to the basket. After removing the wedge, you can release a fantastic looking basket for your ornamental metalwork. This great add-on kit allows your XL Twister to produce an impressive range of decorative features for your projects.